it's Amelia bringing you another Microsoft Word video. In this video, I'll show you how to customize your initials and your username in Microsoft Word. And if you're wondering, well, why would I need to do that? If you notice in this document, I have a comment entered on the right here, and the user is only identified by the word Microsoft. Now in earlier versions of Word, instead of using the Microsoft username, it would use the initials that are set up in Microsoft Word. So let me show you how you can customize that. You want to click File, Options, and in earlier versions of Word, like Word 2007, you click File, Word Options. And then from the Word Options dialog box in the General tab, notice in this section where it says Personalize your copy of Microsoft Office, if you don't, don't change a thing, it's going to just have the word Microsoft here in the username. So I'm going to go ahead and enter in my full name here in the username. And then in Initials, you have the choice of what you want to enter in there, which will also display, depending on how you have your Microsoft Word set up, may display in other areas in your document for other types of tools and functions. So I'm going to go, go ahead and put in my first initial and my last name. Again, you can customize it as needed. So now when I click OK and add a comment, what you're going to notice is my name will appear. Now for older comments, it will still have the original username that was uh, listed in the file options when that comment was entered. But in this case, I entered an additional comment and now my name appears. So let me just show you an example here. In this image, you could see that in earlier versions of Word, if you're not using Word 2016, you may have noticed that initials will appear in the comments like this. But then once you customize the initials, let me flip over to the result, you would see something like this. So in cases where uh, say, for instance, you have a document or maybe you're writing a manuscript or a novel and you send it out for review, you might have more than one person providing feedback information to you. And if that's the case, you definitely want to let them know to customize their initials or their Microsoft username. And then it will be very easy for you to identify who entered the feedback comments into your document. So the difference is uh, in Microsoft Word 2016 has the option uh, that if you're logged into your Microsoft Office account, which I am, then uh, what will happen is the username in the comments will default based on the Microsoft user account name versus if you're not logged into your Microsoft account, then it will default to the initials. Well, that's it for today's video. If you found this video helpful, please leave a comment below. If you like this video, please click like. If you like my channel, please click subscribe. I'll see you in the next video.